Honda Genio 110 review let's get on to it I'll be very honest with you as usual but this time you know it's funny because I try all Honda I review already all Honda scooter so only missing the ADV but out of the click 125 the click 150 and the PCX this one is probably the one I enjoy the most it's the slowest of all of them but it's probably the one I enjoy the most I'll tell you why because it's simple as simple it's very you have nothing on it honestly you have nothing on it so you have the odometer you have the speed and then the brake that's it the 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 basic the basic one from any scooter motorcycle you have nothing else this is why i enjoy the most because it is so simple there is nothing to add nothing to take out the color is great in red like that it's great i love the color do you know this is the first time i actually think about getting one like the pcx was nice i enjoy riding it sorry 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 the pcx i enjoy riding it the click and the air blade was great but this one is probably one of the first one i'm thinking should i get rid of one of my scooter or motorcycle and get this instead this is only 72 thousand for SRP it's not that high this is totally the perfect commuter the perfect city riding I would say going out of town you can you can go for a trip in Tagatai you know but I wouldn't go more far than Tagatai I haven't had the chance to actually take it out and enjoy it outside you know because I was very busy so I didn't really have the chance but City riding is the best and the gas consumption especially at the moment with the gas price the gas consumption is really good over 50 plus per liter 50 km per liter is always in eco mode so you cannot really change it now when you come to the brake system I was surprised I was very surprised about the brake system it's just very very nice look at I'll show you huh? see just very very nice very uh, uh, smooth very smooth and comfortable you know the seat the seat okay I don't think you really need to change the seat to be honest uh, it's not painful at all it, it's slightly hard but me I like it harder you know I sit harder than so, so soft so sit okay it does the job oh oh he stole your place oh you bad sit I'm happy with it maybe you can do a custom sit always you know you can always change things that's the thing with small scooter like that you can change a lot actually I'll tell you what I will change on my part eh? if I get one I will change the bar and mirror first because I love bar and mirror so I'll change the mirror I will probably paint if I get in red I will probably paint the wheel the mag in red add an exhaust the great thing I like about the design is the indicator already inside the scooter, not on the side. So it, you can just take it off this one. You can have a clean tail light. I will put one of my shocks. Tapos. This is the good thing. This is why I love that that scooter is it's very simple. There's not even a clock on it. That will help of course to have a clock, but if you look at it for the price twice as low is 72 something 72,000 maybe 900 let's see 72,000 SRP you got a brand new scooter it's very very good in gas consumption 
and you have almost nothing to change apart if you really want to customize it yourself other than that my wife actually never ride motorcycle so yesterday I just we tried we tried we tried to ride a little bit on a scooter so she likes it so far just need to learn properly but don't be surprised if you see me with one of them soon in the video and I'm using it only to ride on uh, in, around the city you know I went to Canon City with this to pick up my booth in Alpanstar the other day the gas almost didn't change and I make 60 km the gas almost didn't change I put full tank I came back it was still at full tank and it was 50 km uh, 60 I think 67 to go there we did a gas, it's a big gas saver so if you really into something that you can commute and you don't care about going fast this is the one you want um, top speed I'm not sure maybe maybe 90 I'm not sure you have to google it maybe you, f you have to search on google on youtube maybe you will find one I didn't get to the top speed um, it's not something look Yeah, you know what I mean? It's a 110 TC. Don't buy this if you want to be fast as a PCX, ADV or a motorcycle, you know. This is not what it's for. It does the job. It's small. Convenient. The seat might... Actually, the seat might be bigger. That would be better. But I guess when you came to a scooter like that, you know, you cannot really do anything about the seat but you can always put the box it's plenty the good thing with this and the Honda Beat is the same so if you buy a Honda Beat or if you buy a Genio you can get the same uh, parts for both they're both the same so that's the good thing about it if you don't really need to search for Genio part you can just search for Honda Beat Especially in a service, you know, you go to any casa, they can fix the bike. Definitely a winner, this one. Definitely. I know, I know it looked like a... Uh, let's say it like that, eh? It looked like a Vespa. I know. The design shape is similar as an old school Vespa. But that's what I love about it because this one if you look for the original Vespa no? how much is it? it's expensive correct I know it's not the same but it's expensive if you want some old style scooter fashionable Honda Genio and now they actually actually I didn't like the red before I'm not into color like that I'm like on my scooter you know blue black you know, red not so much, but when I saw that one, I really wanted, I really like the color, you know, I really wanted one, a red one. But they actually have the blue one, and they have the black matte now. So, really, Honda is coming up with new design and new, new colors, so that's nice. I'm in the wrong lane, I'm sorry. I will turn on the right on purpose. So you have your two storage on the side, you have the small hook to put the bag. Storage is okay. It's not too big though. But you have a charging socket. So this is very helpful, especially on a small bag like that. I didn't expect to have. So you can fit a few things, a small bag or whatever. Odo is at 1690 so it's very new I think normally when I ride on the scooter when they give me to make a review I ride about 800 to 1000 for the whole time because I'm busy going to work and coming back lately I'm very very busy doing something else so I haven't ride as much as I, as I could but I still ride about 400 kilometers with it a bit less than 400 so 
it's still nice it's still very really good to ride i really enjoy it it's very, mostly city, city riding but it is it is what it is you know it's a small scooter made for city riding delivery rider can ride this uh, usually they use uh, on the bit but you know this is exactly the same as on the bit basically but just the design is much it's not the on the bit is ugly but this one is much much better looking than on the bit to be honest so don't don't be surprised in a few videos you actually see me riding a Honda Genio. It's much possible.